Salons in Douglas County are closed for the next month. While this isn't great news for stylists who rely on their clients for income, they're making the best of it. Chief photographer Stephanie Nolte went to an Omaha salon today to learn what they can do during this closure. Okay, look down again. Salons across the country, once focused on beauty, she's a cutie, are just trying to figure out how to survive. Here in Douglas County, chairs once filled with smiling clients at Hank and Axe sit empty. This week has been tough. Hank and Axe owner Katie Hoke Harrower says her clients have been great, taking advantage of product sales, calling to check in, and even requesting home visits. We can't do that. Um, it puts our license in jeopardy, the salon license and um, the individual's license in jeopardy. Uh, that's just not how we work in this state and so we're following the rules. She says just wait for the professionals. Most do-it-yourself haircuts or dye jobs turn out badly. The chemistry that goes into that um, isn't something that you can just purchase at a grocery store um, or just simply put together and put on your roots. It is a a special formula and um, again, the artistry when you're missing the best part. And guys? I mean, maybe ask like a loved one to help you like clean up your neckline with a basic like razor, but let's stay away from clippers. Just hang tight. Stay loyal to your hairdresser. Stay loyal to your small businesses in town. She says they'll be back in about a month. In Omaha, Stephanie Nolte, 3 News Now.